This is David. He is a geologist. Everyone else in the picture is also a geologist, one of his peers. David, with a fellow geologist and two of his students, wrote an article about some of their research and submitted it to the editor of the Journal of Applied Geophysics, who was also a geologist. The editor sent the article to three or four other geologists for their critique and recommendation on whether to publish the article in the Journal of Applied Geophysics. This is the peer review part of the process. The peer reviewers and editor decided to publish David's article. The editor sent the critiques to David and his co-authors and began to work with them to prepare the article for publication. David's article was published and can now be read by everybody, but especially by any interested geologist and can be used in future research and articles. By the way, the co-author's audience of geologists includes their professors, colleagues, and students, as well as the authors that the co-authors cited in their article. And now we know, because of peer review, that the knowledge presented by David and his co-authors in their article is now a validated contribution to knowledge in the field of geology. Thank you to David Valentino for offering this article as an example for this tutorial. The full text is available to the SUNY Oswego community through Science Direct. For more information, ask a librarian at oswego.edu library.